Live from the Capital City Rifle and Pistol Club in Augusta, Maine, it's an Alba TV review. Hey, it's Donna Losi with Abba, American Women Who Bear Arms. We're going to be doing a review today on the Kydex holster from 45 Tactical Designs. So this is the holster. It has my bodyguard inside of it right now. We're going to go ahead and take this out. And I have cleared and made my pistol safe, but we'll do it again just to make sure. Okay. So, when you first get the holster, it is going to come with 1.75 inch belt loops. For me, these were way too big. When I had put this on my belt, I was expanded out quite a bit and there was no way that I'd be able to wear this as a concealed carry holster. However, contacting the company, they were amazing and they sent me the smaller half inch belt loops. With a little guidance from them, I was able to change out the belt loops myself and once I put this on, it was definitely something I could see myself wearing as a concealed carry holster. The um, tightness of the holster when my pistol would come out, it was really tight at first. And also talking with them, they walked me through some steps that I could do. I was able to take a blow dryer to it, pretty simple at home, heat it up a little bit, work my pistol in and out a few times, and now it's coming out in a much more smooth fashion for me that I'm comfortable with. You can also do it a little longer if that works for you, or if you're comfortable with the way that it is right from the package, then you can leave it in that, the, the tightness that it has. So far, I have been putting my pistol in and out of the holster for about, I would say, three weeks now, and I've been doing it a lot because I've been practicing at home, coming in and out of the holster. And if you want to zoom in here, you will see that there really is not a tremendous amount of wear coming onto the pistol from the Kydex holster. I have seen some holsters that really showed a lot of wear on my pistol, which I'm um, sure most of you maybe feel like me. I don't really like that. So that's a concern for me. This holster has been treating my pistol really nicely, so I'm really impressed with it. You can see the holster through my shirt that I have on today. This is the holster, nice and slim up against me. However, if I wanted to wear this concealed today, I would be covering with either a sweatshirt. I'm going to the range today, so this is pretty comfortable. If I were going out, say to work, I would want to have on a blazer or something in that nature to cover up over top because just having it with a shirt is definitely going to print through. And this would be one of those times where we'd have to talk about wearing a different kind of holster to fit your outfit. Today I'm wearing a different kind of outfit to fit my holster. Coming out of the holster, it's getting a lot smoother the more I've been working with it. I do have a pretty loose belt on, so I'm going to go ahead and hold the holster while I pull out today. However, if my belt were a little bit longer, I can see where this easily would come off very smoothly. So I come out of the holster, just like that. Nice, crisp little pull there. And then I'm ready to go. Practicing at home with your holster, you wanna make sure that you can comfortably where you have it, come out and be ready to engage your threat. And then remember when you're going back into your holster, there's no rush, so you can just slowly go back into your holster. The key is to be able to come out of your holster nice and smooth and quickly when you need to. Again, I have to hold mine because I don't have on the proper belt today, but coming out and engage your threat. And keep in mind, when you come out of your holster, you want to have a nice grip because that's the grip you're going to have when you come out. There won't be much time to change your grip once you come out of your holster. I want to thank 45 Tactical Designs for sending me the holster to try out. It's definitely one that I'm going to be using on a regular basis. And if you are interested, you can go to their website. It is www.45tacticaldesigns.com and check out, they have holsters for outside of the waist, um, inside of the waistband, they have some paddle ones, all sorts of different holsters for many different pistols. So go check them out and while you're there don't forget to pick up your holsters for your the magazine carriers because they have those as well. This has been an Aba TV presentation part of American Women Who Bear Arms online at awwba.com.